Hey, what's up, guys? This is your boy, Next Gen Narrow, man. Uh, today, just, I'm giving you guys, like, a review in progress. I'll probably come back after, like, a week or two. Because, uh, like, unlike a lot of these reviewers, I like to actually put a lot of time and effort into these games before I give you my final judgment. But today is just going to be my first impressions and, you know, early opinions of the gameplay of the only type of horror game in this genre i've you know played and indulged in so i didn't really play dead by daylight and i played a little bit of friday the 13th not too much right so we're talking about T texas chainsaw massacre a day one release with game pass if you have an xbox you can go play this right now it's in there it's great it's fun but you know i'm gonna give you my little opinions of it man so in my opinion it's a very fun horror game um now i like that the gameplay is not biased in favor of the killers of the handful of matches I played, about 10 or 15, um, I escaped probably about, okay, so from the survivor's point, I probably played about five, six matches, seven, give or take, you know, around that. I, I wasn't counting, but I just know it was a handful. And probably escaped probably just under 50% of the time, maybe a little more. So I like that it's not biased towards the killers, and, you know, it is a possibility for you to escape. And that make playing the survivors that much more fun and you don't just only want to play the killers but then on the flip side it's also fun to play the killers it's really dope uh it's five survivors it has a good amount of content um and hopefully more you know update updated you know dlc and, and patches and stuff to come um it has three maps uh and it has customizations for most of the characters which is really dope except for my boy the hitchhiker man which is my favorite you know, he just got his usual joint. You got skill tree and progression that looks great. And it really makes you choose what type of play style you want to have. Overall, I say it's very fun on both sides. It's scary, intense as victims, hilarious, and funny as hell as killers. And uh, you got to be real strategic um, for uh, both of them, for both whoever you play to really make sure you win. Um, it's very fun. You know, my biggest. Oh, and before I get to my complaint. I want to say the game, I'm burning the game on the Xbox Series X. I got a few homies that's running on the Series S, but this game looked absolutely gorgeous. It ran fine at 60 FPS, no dips, no glitches, and even no matchmaking problems besides the slow wait. Well, I take that back. It, I have had a few matchmaking problems where it take, you know, too long for to find a match. And if, you know, you find, you know, full team and then maybe one person quit, like one survivor out of the five leave or one killer out of the three leave sometimes they'll reset the whole queue and now you gotta find new people once again so that was very annoying and i feel like the queues overall was pretty long for a game like this especially since they have reached one million players uh in the first 24 hours and i'm pretty sure t probably seven hundred thousand of them came from game pass because let's be honest we know some of the people don't like games but you know that's the topic for another time but yeah, I really enjoyed the uh the game that I played so far of it, man. And I'm like, and uh, I see a lot. I did see a few people complaining about you know the killers is OP and nah, not really. I think a lot of people probably not paying attention to how you have to build your character, like I mentioned earlier, as far as skill trees and and skill points to really have a build that's useful to you specifically and also your team. Um, a lot of people probably is not doing that, man. Uh. I don't think it's too hard to be a survivor. It's fun, and it's definitely possible to get out of the basement. i just seen a few people complaining, like, you know, three killers is way too much, two killers. I don't Like I said, I don't really see it, man. I think it's a very good game. Um, you know, it's fun. It runs good. It's in Game Pass. I can't complain. One of my favorite horror franchises, the Texas Chainsaw Massacre game. Man, so far, I'm definitely enjoying it.